Okay, one, two, three, ugh. Hey guys, it's Dominique and thank you for coming back to my channel. I truly appreciate it. Today's video is a review on this face wax kit by the brand Flamingo. Now, I didn't do too much looking into this while I was at Target. I did purchase this at Target. Good for the chin, mustache, and unibrow. Now, I do wax my upper lip and chin, but that was sugar wax. So, I'm not sure how this will work. They also have a body wax kit. I just went ahead and got the so you get 20 wax strips ready to use, 10 double sided, one calming serum with lavender and chamomile, six post wax cloths to calm and clean up, gentle wax base, fragrance free and no artificial color. Okay, so open the box. When you open the box, it smells really fresh. Okay, so here, Looks like a little envelope. So it also comes with this precautionary statements slip. And it's basically saying like, do not ingest, um, do not use around your vaginal, genital, or anal areas. Do not use for 24 hours after sunbathing. If you're gonna use it on your uh, armpits, do not use deodorant. So it's just giving you like some need to know information, which is good. Cause some people just, they don't think about it. They just wax and it's like, oh, whatever. It, it's, it's not that simple. Don't, if you're using retinoids or taking any other medication, consult your physician, yada, yada, yada. So when you open this kit, Here is the post wax cloth in this packaging. I like the little flamingo drawing they have, that's cute. So here's the post wax cloth, you get six of them. Here are the wax strips. Here are the wax strips. You get 10 of them, double-sided. Or oh, I'm sorry, 20 of them, double-sided. And more wax cloths. So you get six of them. And it just has a how-to manual on the inside of the packaging. Also, on the inside, you get the calming serum. If I do facial waxing, um, I just got off the shower. I purchased this stuff yesterday when I went to Target. But whenever I facial wax, I don't wash my face with like my benzoyl peroxide stuff, my um, medicated cleansers. I don't use any of that. I just go for like a clean CeraVe product that's not going to irritate my skin at all. Just that's just me. I am old. I don't want to use anything that might irritate my skin, especially if I'm going to be waxing because I'm about to go back to work. My vacation is pretty much over and I don't want to go back to work with a patchy red face. But hair should be at least um, a half an inch long. And I think it is pretty long. It's long enough. It's weird because the more that I sugar wax, the hair like right in the middle is extremely fine, but the hair towards the side, sides grows really long. Yep. So I think I'm good enough to try this. So rip it apart. Kind of smell like glue, like super glue. No. It kind of smells like nail glue. So it says to do a patch test, but you know, I don't, <laughs> I never do a patch test. <laughs> I just go for it and just suffer the consequences, like whatever. 
So, um, let me get this out the way. Okay, so when you're applying wax, I'm assuming whether it's wax or wax strip, applied in the direction, well this is applied in the direction of how the hair grows. And then you're gonna rip it from the opposite direction. This is a close up. Okay, so I got y'all close up just so y'all can see. I took some before and after pictures. My lips do look red and patchy, that's because uh, my lips dried out, cracked out yesterday and I took a hot towel to them last night. So I guess they're trying to heal. I put some um, CeraVe healing ointment on them but they're still kind of like blotchy. And I do have hyperpigmentation um, around my mouth. But anyway. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do it like. Cause honestly, this, it's not that much wax or the length. So I'm gonna go like this. Again, I'm gonna pull okay. bottom to top. <sighs> One, two, ugh. That wasn't bad. I'm gonna try to curve it. Usually when I wax, I, I'm <laughs> sit <in> my trunk. <laughs> I had a couple shots of tequila, so especially when I'm doing my treasure chest. But facial waxing, it's tell. Let me know. Do you prefer or not prefer? Can you tolerate facial hair waxing versus like a bikini wax? Okay, one, two, three. Oh fuck. Oh shit. Okay, I'm gonna try to get this one. Right there. Right there. Oh. Mm. I did go over a few spots. It didn't say I couldn't, so. Woo, child. Now for a post wax cloth. After waxing, use this cloth to soothe and remove any excess stickiness. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that smell. Okay. I don't like the way this smell. This is really strong. Ooh. It's like, what is in here? What is this? Lavender and chamomile. Oh my God, that's why. I read that and I forgot that fast. I am not the biggest fan of lavender. I'm not. Um, Where can I put this at? And it gets, I mean, they not stingy with the product on here. Cause like, it's everywhere. It's, it's definitely a lot. It's a lot of product. Okay, then after that, then what? Mm. 
Now, I see how this is really soothing because, let me, y'all can get off my face. Y'all too close at this point, seriously. Okay, so I can see how this is really soothing because the little ball, roller ball thing here is like that metal um, material or whatever. Go ahead and use the cloth and the serum one after the other because I don't have like that after wax sensation anymore. The cloth, the scent is strong, but that's just me. I'm very sensitive to like fragrance and whatnot, but the cloth is strong, but I do like it. My face is really calm. It's not any like, they're like itchy, uncomfortable sensation anymore. It's pretty much gone away. The only thing is that I'm red, which always happens. I'm red even when I'm not waxing. I'm just, I'm just one of those people that get red really easily, but I like it. I like both the cloth and the serum. The serum is kind of like a step up just because of that metal ball is just really calming. And I like that. It's very, it's like taking an ice cube to your face. Okay guys, I hope you enjoyed this video of me inflicting pain on myself. Again, this wax kit is by the brand called Flamingo. Also, again, they do have a body wax kit. I might try that. If I have any like discomfort, redness, breakout, itching, any problems, uh, skin color doesn't revert back to what it's supposed to be, then I'll give you an update. But so far, so good. This was just like an initial review um, of the Flamingo facial wax kit. For the price for $10, again, at Target, in like the shaving and the uh, body care aisle. For $10, this is not bad. Again, 20 wax strips, one calming serum, and six wipes. The lip is really smooth. The soothing um, treatments definitely, definitely help. So again, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I don't wanna keep rambling. I'll leave a link to this product from Target in the description box below, and I'll see you guys in the next one. If it's another wax treatment or wax product that you think I should look at or test out or whatever, leave me a comment down below, and I'll see you guys in the next one.